Hello and welcome back everyone. Today I got a, I consider it a cool project. I really love cars and especially have a love for the JDM ones. So a while ago when I was starting first the 3D designing, I experimented a lot into a different ideas. And at the time when I was starting with Fusion 316 and I did not know what I'm doing and I wanted to experiment and see what can I make and how easy or how difficult it will be to use to Fusion 316. I came, uh, I basically took uh, my, you can see in my videos, I bought a brand new car, the Honda BRV. I basically took the outline and make it like a, I don't know, like a 2D, a shape of it. I just wanted to see how difficult will something like that to be to design in Fusion 316. And after I came with that idea and I printed the, 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 the file, I wanted to do something, I just wanted to throw it or lay it down. So basically I use it for a monitor, like a monitor, emblem monitor, a display model. I don't know how, how would I call that one. Maybe you can even call it a monitor attachment, but it's not functional or anything. It's just for looks. So after that, and I, I did like it, how it looks, I came with a second idea, with a second uh, model, but I didn't do the outline, I almost did the whole car. I filled the whole car instead of doing the lines and everything. And this is the one that I came with. This is a GTR and it's an R35. You can see it. And like I said, I just, I use and I cut the the outlines of the doors, of the rims and everything. And it really, I really like how this came up. I never released this one just because I was not sure at that time if people will like it. And at that time that I, I came with this idea, I did not, uh, I, when I came the first idea, not this one, the first, the Honda BRV, which I never released uh, just because I was not uploading online. Uh, you know, I'm not uploading my project because I did not know if people will like it. But now that I know that people like my ideas, like my designs and do download a good amount of my, pro of my files. So, like I said, I came with this idea, but with this uh, second one, this GTI, but I made this uh, uh, for sale basically this was a, a file that you have to purchase from a website so you can print that one but i remove it from there just because i didn't have many i didn't have i think i had only one sale on this one but i remove it from there and i made it available for free in thanks to 3d if i'm saying it right so this file is there and the only thing is you're gonna get like i said two pieces you're gonna get the main body and you're gonna get this piece here and basically this thing fits over your monitor of course you can scale this piece down to fit your monitor but for me it fits just fine and basically this is what you're gonna get you know it's a simple and nice idea i mean it doesn't take much space doesn't doesn't distract you from uh, doing your work on your computer or something like that but this is a really nice idea and i named this one i made it monitor riders if people really like this one, I'm gonna make more variation, like maybe a Supra or EA86 or something like that. But this isn't today's project. I just wanted to tell you where I get the idea. I did like the monitor riders. I like the name and I like that you can have something like that on your monitor, but I wanted to have something that I can hang on the wall. And I know that you can buy things like that online and I've seen them in like uh, advertisement that you can buy something like that online, but I wanted to make it by my own and make it free for everyone to download and print. So let me show you with what did I and make. Those are the first models that I came with. This will be four files in this one. I'm gonna call them World Riders. And those are basically JDM le legends. We're gonna start with the GTR and we're gonna go down to the Supra. I'm gonna make more if people really like that and may do a second part. If not, I may just leave it as is. So let me show you the models. So let's start, of course, classic. We got the GTR R34, and it's very easy to attach them to the wall. As you can see, I just used some black nails and I just nailed them down. You can use tape, you can use whatever you want. I, build, I made it, all the wheels have holes in them so you can use nails to attach them, but if not, you can just use a double side tape. But of course, like I said, we got the GTR, we're gonna have the Mazda RX-7. Of course, we're gonna have the classic Toyota EA86. And one of my favorite cars, the Toyota Supra. All of them are very easy to print, very little material. And of course, I don't want it to make them small because the original file comes almost half of the size of them. So you, these ones are scaled 60% up from the original size. So you may adjust it however you want it to fit. But yeah, this, these are 60% bigger, all of them. You can make them bigger if you can slice them in your slicer to have it like 
really big make them for the whole world i don't know but you can do that but like i said those are 60 percent scale up so that's up to you you can do them small big or whatever you want if you will go a little bit too small you may lose some of the data so i don't recommend going less than maybe 20 percent smaller from the original files just because of very thin lines and yeah so basically this is our project today this is our designs today like i said if people do like that one i will make more but for a moment these four are the one that we're gonna release i'm gonna call them like i said monitor riders jdm legends i may do a german version i may do american like with muscle size no one knows but for now all of them look really nice on my wall very easy to attach very easy to print Again and again, like all of my models, this will be all free to download. All the links will down will be down in the description. I hope you like it. Subscribe, like, and share. And I hope I will see you in the next one.